let's craft me hide outfit. It will give me some isolation from cold, not as much as the fur, of course, but it's always better than nothing. And jacket, please. Thank you. I made it nice. And there's weaving loom. We'll get to sales in a second. Let me just wear my clothes. <laughs> well, that's actually pretty cool looking. Yeah, I like it. It's bulky. And I'm not cold anymore. Let's go outside and see how cold I can be. Because nights are super cold. Okay, I'm only cold. I'm not freezing. So this will help me survive. Alrighty, yeah, let's get to sales. Two speed sales. Check. Steering wheel. Check. Why is it raining in my house? Whoa. What is it, some kind of hole here? I need more wood, so let's see how my hide outfit is doing oh you see it's not good enough oh my goodness now let's talk about skills because i need to get something more like piracy why because piracy basics of piracy will give me grappling hook which is awesome and then captain earring which will also unlock navigator's tools and why I need that? I need that for basics of crew, which will give me ship resources box and food larder. And these are very useful on the ship. Now I've unlocked also sword because I need that melee, especially uh, for like when the, the creature is too close to me. Oh, I can see the sun. Still raining though. But the sun is up so now i'm gonna make sword food larder and that storage resources box which is quite cool i will show you in a minute food larder check and ship resources box check simple sword check grappling hook check counted that 32 elements of ceiling I will need so let's get to it plot twist I won't really need 32 pieces of ceilings for my ship because I will customize it in a different way but let's fill the deck up I think here will be fine to simply make stairs down to the lower deck, right? Right. And to make it look nice, let's build some railing. Yes. And here, why I didn't fill it up? Well, here I'm gonna build kind of podium for the steering wheel. But let's get sails now. In front sail. Let me check from the distance. I think it will be nice if it was here, right? Here. What now? Now I have larder, which is going to be here. And now ship resource box, which I'm going to put here. And let me quote from Gamepedia, link in the description below. Notable differences between the ship resources box and other standard storage structures are half a million which is 
500,000 stack limit, unlimited inventory space, and the unique feature of automatically collecting the materials from any demolished ship components. Also, when the ship is anchored, crew members will also pull from this box for resources to repair, if possible, and any gold coins stored in this box will also be automatically pulled to pay crew's wages. I forgot to add that food and food larder, my goodness, this is too, too loud. The food in the food larder will spoil um, after four times longer than if I keep it in closet or in my inventory. So, for example, five minutes to spoil, put it in food larder, it's 22 minutes because it was like five minutes and a couple seconds, right? Nine minutes, almost 10. In food larder, it's almost 40. It's not as good as, my goodness, stop that. It's not as good as preservatives here, a preserving bag and s with salt. Uh, the, the sound of closing and opening food larder is too loud. It would be nice if it was fixed. Uh, like I said, now I'm going to get to the podium. All right, the sun is up. Let's build me a podium. It's like captain's deck. Yes. So I don't want it to be like too high. Oh my goodness, it's raining again. So here's captain's deck, right? Captain's bridge, whatever. Um, now pointy floor for the steering wheel and here we have to cover it naturally yep and rails here All right. Hello, lion. Hello. Perfection. Yes. And this part of the ship will be a little buggy because of the railing. Like, look. See, I cannot go here, so it's gonna be a little buggy. Well, that's bad, because you cannot actually jump on the rail, as well as on the, see, on the top of this, where is it? On the top of this, see, I'm floating here. Let's see the sword. Well, it's... Oh my goodness. That was unexpected. Stupid lions. I hate them. I hate them so much. Barriers for water. I don't know why too, but I can always pick them up and... Uh, and throw away. <laughs> and I can jump on them, so... And watch the horizon and what and simply here no 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 here fireplace because I need to cook somewhere in the future I will just put grill under the deck but we'll see about that I was thinking and thinking and thinking and Finally, I know the name for my schooner. As I mentioned, or maybe not, this schooner will serve me for exploration, expedition. There is no combat ability on it, right? It's just super fast to get resources and stuff like this. So let's release the ship first, because it's not the, the building is the customization is not over. Let's release the ship and let's call it Amelia. 
It's after Amelia Earhart. It was the first female pilot who crossed the Atlantic Ocean. So I think that's a good name for my first ship. In honor to the lady. Whoops, almost fell down. Okay, let's sail out of the dry dock because we will need to add some elements to it. Okay, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. Stop. I don't like that ladder on the back of the ship. It's, it's good for, you know, like emergency, but I prefer ladder on the side. It's not like the biggest ship, of course, looking at the mighty galleon on the, on the background, but it's quite big and it cannot park like, like sloop, like my rascal close to the shore so I can jump out. So we will need a dinghy and dinghy needs special, uh, what is it? Hangar, how it's called. We have it all the way down here. Yes, dinghy dock. So yeah, it's dinghy ship hangar. Also, secrets of piracy because this unlocks diving attachment. And I must say that I have not tested diving attachment yet or diving suit. So first, our little rowboat hangar here. Yes, and diving attachment here. So, as you can see now, what was that? It will look quite interesting, like, like a ship with some kind of wings. But that's fine. And also I crafted smithy bench for here under the deck. Let's put it somewhere like here because we will need to repair tools and maybe craft something new. So this is always needed on the ship. Okay, we have everything needed for rowboat, aka dinghy, and we have it. Now we can release it. I cannot because it would hit the, the dock, so I will re release it later. And... This will require oil. Now I can equip diving suit. See? Just oil, so I didn't have to craft diving suit. And I can damn it. Wow, this will be this will Um how can I Hello? <laughs> <laughs> I want to get up. And last but definitely not least, and very useful, will be, I'm cold, and will be ladder. So some stuff that we have no access to on the open sea, which is wood definitely, hide, one stack, uh, some metal, uh, maybe 50 for tools. Um, but we can get that on the land and tools will not break on the ship. I, I, I hope not. Let's get shovel. Um, I have some arrows, bones, maybe once like 100. Uh, meat is go. Whoa, I'm over encumbered now. Okay, now we can put down the dinghy. Whoa. Okay, and I will install ladder. Dinghy requires stamina. Stop, 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 stop. So I think here will be... Okay. Whoa, only here? Well, that's fine. Also, ladder here would be nice. Right, and we have ladder here. Whoa, it's freaking high, <laughs> but it's awesome. Right, 
Right. And that's it, actually. Let me park the boat. Very nice. Well, <laughs> it's evening. So, good evening. And... That would be it. The ship customization is done. Well, painting. That we will leave for future episodes. One of the future episodes. Because it requires uh, cooking. And I want to get to cooking like another time. That would be it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next episode or in other videos. Feel free to subscribe to the channel, it helps a lot. Thank you very much for all the subscriptions. And that's it. Bye.